What is this game we got? Social media happily ever after. What is this game? Love a game. I don't know. Love a good these, game. These are just TikTok couples, and you say if they think they're going to make it or if they're going to. Oh. No. <gasps> no, 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 no. Yeah, well, let's yeah, see yeah. them anyways. <laughs> let's do it anyways. <laughs> I'm here for this. Dixie and Noah. Oh, they are so precious. If there's one out of all of them. Nah, it's, it's not them. Oh, why do you say so? Because Anthony and Avani are way better of a relationship, dude. Okay. I'm rooting for Dixie and Noah. I'm super I'm not rooting saying for them. they won't. I'm just saying if you're picking the number one, it's Avani and Anthony. You're biased, though. You live with I'm Anthony. I'm not even biased. I'm just talking about, like, drama and relationship and shit. He's like right. The because drama you, online. They've had, like, breakup, split up, breakup. You, once you go, go down that path, eh, Avani and Anthony... No. I will say though yes. these two are under the microscope way more. I feel that's like, a, than uh, yeah. I guess that's a good point. Yeah, yeah I don't think they ever broke up. The internet just said they did because they stopped. Yeah, posting. well, Dixie wouldn't put it to rest. You ask her point blank and she won't answer it. So yeah. that's a good point. I guess so. I respect her her like ability to keep some of it private though. But I mean, they've been going. They've been going yeah. for a long time. So it's like, listen, I'm a Dixie stan. So I yeah. hope so. Yeah, you yeah. Them. Doa. Definitely hope it lasts. Doa. Slay. Slay. <laughs> Addison and Omar. They're like, my, oh my God. Aesthetically, that's just my shit. I love a dying looking man with a body. I love mm -hmm. it. It just oh makes me wet. So, so what does that mean, a dying look? That sounds to me like an insult. You didn't mean it. No. So. Oh my God. Well, I mean, that's my type of man. I talk about someone it Someone who looks like, like they're dying? Someone who looks Sickly. like they eat cigarettes. Like corpse, yeah. You know what I mean? In a hot way, though. In a very hot way. Got it. I love their aesthetic. Like, I th I think, I know a lot of people think it's like, a, oh, she should have been with Bryce. They were way cute. I think this was like a crazy. It makes more sense. Upgrade has a negative connotation, but I mean, like, I love this relationship. Well, you can't have a real relationship with Bryce. True. <laughs> yeah, kiss everybody in LA. I, I love Addison. I, I honestly could see them lasting too. I think it's like the way he's so private is such a good balance for her. Like, I just saw the cutest photos of him today. I stand. Okay. Just me. No Can chance. Pee. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. You but what if she so? needs the funny guy? What if she needs the? This the isn't funny, even. Sweet this guy. not necessarily her. Both of them. Neither. No chance. Zero. Zip. Zero. Yeah, I don't think it's just. <laughs> I don't know. Kim. I don't uh, think just Kim's gonna be like the one to dip. I think Pete might just be like, ah, I'm done. I'm so. I want. I'm rooting for them more than I'm rooting for anything in my own life, which is pathetic. But it's super. Well, pathetic. he came out saying he yeah. wants kids. <laughs> he wants kids soon, and she always wants kids. She, How many you kids think she does just she wants to keep already? turning them out? I think so. That's what the Kardashians uh, do. Like, yeah, yeah well, you know what? Yeah, it's like cheating it. because they don't actually give birth and they have someone else do all the shit. So I guess if you're just doing them slay. as ornaments, it's right. Yeah. Right. Right. Not a yeah. good slay. <laughs> That's a good point. Zero. Not Dave's answer. <laughs> the silence was deafening. Yeah, I mean, um, I think the silence was the answer. Probably right. There, I mean, there. It's new. Who knows? Yeah, I don't know anything about the relationship. They're, it's so new. They, I, I just know they look Bullshit, you aesthetically don't. great. You love him, Bree. I do. I think they look so cute together. I don't know. You can't but, even see your fucking you, face in this picture. Not this <laughs> fucking picture, but there's other pictures of them. And I just you think love they, him. You stand they look him. better. I do stand him. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Charlie's biggest fucking fan. If she's happy, I'm happy. I right? love her. I don't know. I've never spoken cute. with Charlie in my life. Really? Yeah, never. Damn. I've talked to a nice person. They're both nice. They're nice she's, people. She's an angel. I'm just like not like I wouldn't say I'm close with either of them. Amanda and Keo. So they're so, back. We we speculated on this, but they're they're good now. Yeah. I just saw a TikTok of them today. You know the trend where it's like it's the it's, it's usually with couples or like friends and they're looking at each other and it's like I like you'd you'd look at me and you'd be like, Tana, I just love how much you do your own thing. You're so late to everything and you yeah, don't yeah. show like you're condescendingly saying things you mm -hmm. like love about the other one in the couple. They did one of those today and I was like, the girls are fighting. Like it was giving like That's super, awkward. It was awkward a little to watch. Yeah. So you're saying they won't last? I no, they've been together for a long time and Amanda's such she's a wifey material girl. I love her. I agree with that. Um so I, I kind of think, I don't know. But I mean, didn't they just break up and get back together? I don't know. The way I've heard Keo talk about her is like, this is the love of his life and he Aww. never wants to leave Amanda. Oh, so yeah. they did break up and get back They're together. Cute. Yeah. No. Well, they, well, when we were talking about it, she was like, nothing has changed. Don't ask about it. So I don't know if there was like something choppy, but. Again, I, like I don't understand that. And I like Amanda a lot. I like Keo. I don't understand that answer not just for them but it's kind of like the dixie like if you're with somebody like hey are yeah. you and sylvana still dating yes like well dave remember dating, the tattoo hand the tattoo video 
where there was yes, another yeah, hand yeah, yeah, yeah. that You're was right. her. That's yeah. yeah, I know. That's why I'm saying we thought there was trouble in paradise. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Courtney and Travis. I think together everyone forever. hates them. I love them. <coughs> I love them. I actually think they're going to last. I've never seen two people more in love than them. Yeah, they're so, like, goals. They're almost yeah. so in love. It makes sex, you like, be like, in front of you. fuck you guys. You know what I'm saying? It makes me want to lay in traffic. Yeah, how you're just like, fuck this, bro. Like, it's uh, Like, it's so cute. Yeah, why are you yeah. doing this to me? I think that's why I like Landon, because I want to think that he's like him. I agree that Landon and Charlie are giving right that wow yeah wow i think that's why maybe i like Landon them. saw his dad kind of and if his dad's such a good lover maybe he's a good lover too yeah, so i think clean. you guys are kind of like grasping at some pretty hilarious straws <laughs> like, <laughs> landon, landon <laughs> fucking yeah, yeah year, landon's like 17 18 years old <laughs> yeah he's like yeah oh, i don't I think i don't think that life. landon's figured out uh <laughs> yeah. like how to be the well i want to i want to think that though do you also have an affinity for like die like tattooed like type of men yeah they always make fun of me for the people i think are hot on this podcast because we both just did the same thing we're like pete yes landon and charlie does your boyfriend have any tattoos i'm working on it okay so you're gonna turn your boyfriend into yeah sex. i've already changed like his whole style and stuff yeah that's awesome you'd want a head tattoo like that not uh, maybe not fucking that but like well tattoos. i mean he does that yeah. to cover up his like, baldness it, well no it's it's because he got into the plane crash oh sorry yeah yeah yeah, yeah didn't yeah, know yeah. that well, Hasn't he, always he, had tattoos he got a or no? mm-hmm. he was in Honestly. a plane crash and he's the only one that survived in the plane crash and no he had a, kidding i didn't yeah. know that that's crazy on a they, private jet yeah, they just started jet. flying again and uh, yeah courtney was the first uh, there's like a picture he posted and he's like with you anything is possible and it's like them in front of a he got on a plane together. for the first time it, yeah he would but he would drive or take boats everywhere he went no kidding when was that plane crash it was years ago. Yeah, yeah, it was Early a while ago. Early 2000s, I think. He, like, 80% of his body was burned. Yeah, and skin they thought graph, he would never, like... He had to have an entire skin graft, jet fuel, lost soaked a, onto lost his Lost all foot. his people. Yeah, that's yeah, terrible. Best yeah. friend, best friend passed. It was it was a really horrific thing. It's, like, yeah, it sounds it. It's so sad. Yeah. It's crazy. Damn, tragedy. No. <laughs> Julia and Jake. <laughs> no. Would y'all have done this one if I wasn't here? Uh, Probably not. I mean, probably Jake probably has not, a fight no. in a week. He's in the news. Not sure okay. sure I was just sure curious. Sure 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 do you ever miss Jake? Yeah, do you ever oh like, like lay in bed and just think about him? I could see these two lasting. I yeah, I mean that's that is the this is the thing at hand and I never want to, you know. You think they last? I guess they, I just they, see they, social media stuff and I feel same. like they're beefing every other like six. I feel I like they've been through the whole, stuff. I feel like they've been through a lot. Yeah. She like they're obviously very in love and, you know. Okay. Their posts are very cute and like Maybe I misspoke. Yeah, I, I just don't, I don't like speaking on it. Like any one of my exes really like new mm-hmm. related because it's just like, you know. But you, you like were a, a fake marriage. That, that marriage is fake, right, Tana? The marriage, absolutely. Like, yeah, you right. know, like reality television bullshit. But I also was like, I was also very caught up in it. Like in that world, you know what I mean? For like with Jake. For but there were real feelings there. Like At least on my end, I never want to speak for him. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fair. <laughs> oh, you kind of gave it away. No, I chance. love when anyone else is getting violated but me. Thank God we moved on. Nessa and Josh. Look at that photo. Yeah, look at us, youngins. Nessa and Josh. I Josh, I saw this TikTok the other day. Yeah. That was it was a three minute or two. It wasn't, wow. it wasn't a 15 Ooh. seconder, it wasn't a 60 seconder. And it was all these photos of you guys and all these really cute sentiments that you had both said about each other, like mashed up into one audio. Yeah. And I, I it was the first time because I didn't I didn't know either one of you really then, like at right, all. And right, I didn't know right. anything about your relationship other than the occasional like Alex Warren vlog clip or something. <laughs> yeah. And it was the first time I'd ever heard you guys speak about each other. And I was like, damn, damn. Yeah. Damn. I mean, that was kind of BFF. I felt like thing. right right when it started, Nessa yeah. came on and I mean she was like a super shy girl, really. Like she didn't she was understated, whispering. I think yeah, she she's hates came us. I think she hates us now, right, Austin? I just, I, yeah, I don't think she's <laughs> super happy with us. Yeah, she doesn't like us yeah. very much. I don't. Yeah, I just think I'm, that she's going through I'm a out. bunch, obviously, right now, and it's like it's shitty to add the social media drama onto everything that she's. That was mature going and through, awesome. You know? That was mature and awesome of you, Josh Slay. Thanks. Well, it's his girlfriend, so I hope so. Um, it's not my girlfriend, guys. <laughs> oh, Bonnie man. and <laughs> yes, they're gonna get married. I'm gonna be the best man. Josh is fucking <laughs> pissed now. <laughs> I wanted to be um, happy for this one when it came up, and now I'm in a pissy mood. But yes, I will be your best man, Anthony. I feel like we see this picture of him in this red suit every time, and every time, I'm like, that's a fire suit. <laughs> Dude, is he ever a 
good dresser, man. He styled me for bad thing the seventies party. Like I know <coughs> the David party. I was styled by Anthony. And I knew. Yeah, say, all you had to do was go. Everyone into his was Your like, fit? "You look sick, Josh. You should have been born in the seventies." Honestly, like, Josh, yeah. that should be. I saw you at the David party, and I was like, "Damn, okay, Josh." Like, I think Thanks. that should be your style. Who from is David? What's the David on? party? David, David Dobrik. Oh, oh, oh. David yeah. Dobrik's back having parties, huh? Yeah, yeah. B-day you back. know, it was actually pretty sick. I got to introduce Andre Drummond onto the stage to rap. That was pretty cool. The basketball was, player. Yep, he was there, and we like he hung out rapping. for a bit. He, like took photos. You like, yeah. He he asked to come on the podcast, or like they were like, yeah, it'd be cool to come on the podcast. But hmm. yeah, it was pretty cool. 